this wonderful chant, I don't think, I don't know of any other chants that are done to Psalm 24. This is written by Barnby. I think Barnby started the Bach Choir. He conducted the Bach Choir in the 19th century. And I think it was him that got the Bach B minor mass over and did the first performance in this country during the, um, it was either him or Mendelssohn who did it. But anyway, he was a great figure in English music. He also was, before that, early on, he was director of music, presenter at Eton. And because I followed him, I, not immediately, <laughs> after about um, seven other people, there are one or two things that he obviously had an influence in that are still there. And one of them is how to harmonize the unison bits of this chant. And we've spoken, Mark, haven't we, about um, when, when you want to make it extra special, you add that harmony. So not normally. Normally, first and third quarters are in unison. And then, but then when it gets exciting towards the end, and this is an exciting psalm, it's about what, how, it's first of all about saying, proclaiming God as the great Lord. When he says he hath founded it upon the seas, they actually believed that the earth was built. It was a kind of floating on the seas. And also, and that rain came through little shutters which were stars at night. You could see them letting the light through. And that also let the, let the rain in through the great dome. And, um, and then who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord or who shall rise up in his holy place? Even he that hath clean hands and a pure heart and hasn't lifted up his mind unto vanity nor sworn to deceive his neighbor. He shall receive the blessing from the Lord and and so on. Who is the king of glory? One lot ask, and the others reply, even the Lord of hosts, he is the king of glory. And I'm going to ask us um, not to do the Gloria this time, because the Gloria wasn't added till the early church added it. So can we just end this time, just to see how it feels, end with verse 10, which is how it would have ended and uh, we'll just finish there and, and, and let it be conclusive. So let's rehearse this, go through it, and, and see what we like. Okay? Ralph, where yeah. do you. Um, shall I add the harmonies in verses 7, 8, 9, and 10? Or is that too much? I think 7, 8, 9, 10. Brilliant, yes. Okay. Yes. And possibly Gloria as well. Let's see how it goes. I, I could do that for the moment. Okay, here we go. The earth is the Lord's and all that there is. <coughs> Remember the thing about reading ahead. Just read ahead. And um, it goes for whenever one is speaking in public. When one's speaking in public, one sees words and one thinks, oh, I must read every single word, otherwise I might get them wrong. And so one reads them in an inexpressive way. But read ahead, you will process them and you will, you will sing the thought and the feeling rather than the list of words. any of that was a bit stodgy. Okay, do you think that it should have gone on faster at various places, those people? Why didn't you then? <laughs> Get it? So that's what, how we rehearse, okay? Just do it. If the idiot next to you is, is all slow and st stodgy, just carry on singing, okay? And we'll leave me to work out who was right. Okay, so from the beginning, do it how you think it should go, not how, the per how you think the person next to you will do it. And it doesn't have to be huge loud. Just because it says 40, you don't have to draw blood. Okay, here we go. <laughs> I 
rising, for he hath founded it upon the seas. Do that. Go. For he hath founded it upon the seas. I reckon I went faster than you, don't you, Mark? <laughs> Certainly. Yeah, right. Well, can't you do it? For he hath founded it upon the seas. Go. For he hath founded it upon the seas. Yeah, that means so much more to me. For he hath founded it upon the seas. And go. For he hath founded it upon the seas. the most important word of that? Who shall ascend into the hill of... I think who, isn't it? Who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord? Is it? And any other votes? I, I thought we did hill, but... Maybe who I'm shall sure. ascend into the hill of the... Any other possible candidates for the important word in that clause? Lord. The? The. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord? Hill of the Lord. I think law. Uh, second the. Sorry, I didn't think. I wasn't specific. Sorry? Second the. Sorry, I wasn't specific first time. Yes, okay, thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Hill of the Lord. <laughs> yeah, okay. No, who, who shall I send? Who. Definitely who gets my vote. You reckon who? Yeah, who? who Good, I agree with Who, who shall I send into the Hill of the Lord? Yeah. Yeah that's, yeah, that's what you would say if you were a politician or an evangelist standing in front of lots of people. Who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord? You wouldn't say, who shall ascend? You wouldn't say, who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord? Well, you wouldn't say it in that camp voice anyway. So anyway, <laughs> who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord? And go. Who shall ascend into the hill of the Lord? choirs to cross out forte and write mezzo forte. Don't bother to do that, but could you sing those last two verses mezzo forte instead? In other words, just don't, uh, dynamics in Psalms I often think are, are a bit irrelevant. Just sing it as it is, what it means, you know. And if you see forte, you think, oh, I've got to, right, let's sing it loudly for mummy. Who shall I say? And you absolutely rip it out. Don't, just sing it meaningfully okay who shall ascend into the here we go who shall ascend ah. who shall ascend into the hill of the lord much better or who shall rise up in his holiness i think or who shall rise up in his and and go or who shall rise up in his holiness answer the question I agree with you. You described a person. You, uh, for, for two m verses, you've been saying, what kind of person does this? What does, uh, then in verse five, you say, he shall receive. He shall receive the blessing. That's the one that will receive. So I think a little bit longer on he, and then go straight on after that. He shall receive the blessing from the Lord. And don't hang about after that. And he shall receive a blessing from the Lord. Do you think we can make it more poignant by making it really quiet, as Mark implied by his accompaniment? Uh, that's got, that gets the answer yes, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> okay. He shall, so let's change that to piano. He, but an intense piano. IP. Okay. Here we go. Piano. He, a storytelling piano. STP. He shall ascend into the... Shall we have SD? No, I'm sorry, get off. He shall receive... Here we go. Ah. He shall receive a blessing from the Lord and righteousness from the God of his salvation. This is the generation of them that seek him. He will not seek thy face, O Jacob. Jacob. 
That's how you say it in English, Jacob. If you're in Latin, if you're singing the bird, sing joyfully. You sing Jacob, but here, Jacob. Okay, here we go. Lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be ye lift up. Lift up your heads, O ye gates, and be ye lift up, ye everlasting doors, and the King of glory shall come in. Who is that? Who is the King of glory? It is the Most Strong and Mighty, the Lord Almighty, Give yourself time to do. Everyone go. That's right. Again. Now go. Okay, that's it. Even the Lord of hosts, he is the even. Go. Even the Lord of hosts, he is the king of glory. Result. I'm so sorry, we're not doing, and we're not doing the Gloria, okay? Even the Lord of hosts, he is the King of glory. Good, well done. Any, any questions, any disagreements? Um, Ralph, just, I'm going to take my Yes, so it's, it's E major, um, C sharp minor, F sharp major, or you can add a G sharp if you like. Ravel would have done, yeah, good, and then, and then the next one was right here. If you like the G sharp again. Yeah, yeah. And that is my only thing for going on that is an ancient chant book, which we had in Eton, had that written in in pen. So I sort of like to think that Barnby had said, this is what we want for the reharmonization of the unison verses. Okay, let's do it all the way through. Thank you. 